Luke Gatwood. I'm a photographer. I'm um, from Essex, so I've been living in London for over 20 years. The story behind the photographs tonight is that um, when I was probably about nine, I actually saw a documentary on TV, a documentary called Rivers of Sand. It's about the Ethiopian tribes of people. And since then, I've always wanted to go and photograph these people. The tribes of people who live in an area of Ethiopia called South Omo. It's a, it's a, um, a, a protected park now, and they actually are all diminishing peoples. I'm from Scarborough, North Yorkshire, and I'm a documentary photographer. My work is on the Sahado, which is um, one of the four big biomes of Brazil. Um, the Sahado um, has uh, arguably as big a biome as the Amazon, yet it's been deforested three times faster, um, and nobody's talking about it. The Brazilian government has been um, commended a lot for uh, its prevention of deforestation in the Amazon and slowing down the deforestation rate but uh, in reality it's just turned its attention on the Sahado. Um, only 3% of the Sahado is, uh, is protected and um, it's just been annihilated. I'm currently living in London, Stoke Newington, and kind of photographer, I guess, social documentary. When I was asked to show at the print space, I was asked to show something that hasn't been exhibited before. So I started thinking about projects that um, were kind of relevant to everybody and something that the audience could relate to. And a lot of the audience I knew would be photographers because it's at the print space. And I actually did this project to kind of go back to my roots and it's something that's ongoing. It's more of a just a kind of fun project. It actually originates from just going back to street photography and reminding myself why I capture images. One of the reasons that I use print space is haste. Um, if I need something printed and I need it instantly, I know that it will be a reliable establishment that will just do that. I can upload a file and bam, it will be out in a matter of like a few hours max. It's, um, it's brilliant because I'm a very hands-on sort of photographer. I do my own retouching and things like that. And, and to actually just about output exactly what I'm doing, I find it so much easier. I don't like dealing with printers actually. I find it's amazingly good. And of course, it's so economical.